What the? Are you kidding me? I need to keep pumping pressure into it. I was gonna say, even at full pressure, I might as well just whip my bird out and piss on it. This is not very effective. Will people stop driving past me? Okay, this is dangerous. What's up, guys? Welcome to Paperville Panic. A strange little VR game I came across that's all about a tiny little paper town and fire. You know, that one thing that tiny paper towns really don't like. Now, judging by the terrifying gloves and the hats, I would assume that we're going to be a member of the fire department. But I don't really know how to wear a hat, apparently. <laughs> okay, good training. How do I wear a fire department hat? Hey, you! Yes, you! Hello? Hey! Over here! I have an Australian ghost yelling at me. With the hat! The hat! The hands! The hands. Me up. Oh, oh, oh! Welcome, rookie! Congratulations on becoming our newest recruit! Thank you! Now this is the real deal! I hope you're ready to get your hands dirty! Playtime is over! No more training drills! You got that? These hands don't get dirty, okay? They're just- Nod your head if you understand! They're just very magnetic! Nod your head if you understand! Oh! Okay, time to start the training drills! Sorry I can't be there today! It was my roster day off! I didn't want to mess up the system! We were going to get Greg to do the training, but the last thing we need is another Greg! Oh yeah, screw Thanks Greg! technology, I can keep an eye on you from here! Creepy. Now let's get to it! This ain't no game. We've got rules. First rule, stop standing around, you lazy bum. I, I, I don't know how to move. Day, I've got you a little something. Make sure you turn on the lights. The lever is over by the stairs. <laughs> I thought he was going to say he got me a TV in to turn it on because that, that might be a little difficult. <gasps> okay, so I need to go turn the lights on. Go turn the lights on. What the hell is happening to my hands? Why do I have so much dexterity? I've never seen this in a VR game before. I'm, I'm sitting here trying to figure out what button it is to move, and instead I'm, I'm giving people the okay sign. That's not what I'm going for. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Careful. Uh, there we go. Yeah, ev everything is okay. So we just need to click you on. Beauty of opposable thumbs. Yeah, beauty. I am here for firefighter training, right? Because this looks a lot more like a surprise birthday, and it wouldn't be a very good surprise birthday because I can see it coming, and it's not my birthday. Now we've been working on some high-tech equipment, real state-of-the-art fire suppression systems, and it's all yours. Go on, open the box. You got me high-tech fire suppression technology for my birthday? <laughs> I'm disappointed, it's not even my birthday. What is that? This is the Armageddon Mark 24B. It may not look like much, but it's got it where it counts. If it trips for more than four hours, see a technician. The Armageddon? Now we can stand around here all day and talk about our feelings, or we could do what we are here to do. Handling fire is serious business, so we've set up a high-intensity stress-inducing simulation. High-intensity stress-inducing ducks? Do we shoot? Oh, shoot the fire ducks! That, that would make a whole lot more sense. <laughs> Nothing like training to combat fire using cardboard fire. I, I don't think this is gonna go too well. I mean, not, besides the fact that I have a dollar store squirt gun. <laughs> Please do not send me into a real fire situation with this thing, okay? I don't care how much of a badass name it has. I'm not gonna be able to get the job done. This entire place is flammable. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Nice shooting, Tex. That concludes this part of your training. Now we have at least one hour and 49 minutes left of training, but hey, it's not like we've ever had a fire in Paperville. Next lesson, lunchtime. All this chicken talk has got me hungry. Fortunately, I brought you food to celebrate your first day. It's in the fridge in the lunchbox marked Greg's. Now I know it says do not touch, but that's just the thing. What, what? What's that? Wait, is that the fire alarm? 
No, it can't be. It must be a mistake. It's a lunch, Say, lunch Sam bell, dinner bell. Cranking again? Oh no. It's real. It's really happening. Just my luck. We're all gonna die! <laughs> Rocky, I need you to go to the apartment and check it out. I'd do it myself, but uh, I think it's better to give the new recruit the experience. <laughs> the apartment? It's all about delegation, after all. Could you be a little bit more specific? Which are, okay, no, it'll just bring me there. There's apparently only one apartment in town. Shit, Rocky, that fire's raging like a bull in an origami shop. You've got to get in there, Rocky. That's the mayor's apartment block. Well, look, that's all fine and dandy and stuff, but I may or may not have forgotten my Armageddon 6000 at home. The, the cat seems to be having a perfectly fine time with the fire, and people are, are still having lunch and, and driving around. Maybe, maybe it's not that big of a deal, right? Um, actually, those gloves could look better. Excuse you! Bitch, you better run! It's not in the back of the fire truck, and nobody is helping me right now. You got anything else for me, disembodied Australian voice? Okay, I, I got it. I got it, okay? Everything is under control, folks. We are going to suppress this fire. What the, are you kidding me? I need to keep pumping pressure into it. I was gonna say, even at full pressure, I might as well just whip my bird out and piss on it. This is not very effective. Will people stop driving past me? Okay, this is dangerous. Rule one to being a good firefighter is staying calm and not raising your voice and peeking the microphone all the freaking time. Okay, I'm sorry for that, guys. I'm losing my cool, but I'm just not getting anywhere with this. <laughs> Does anybody have a hose? Does anybody have a... Uh, Fire ext- oh! I need to enter the level. Again, something I would have really appreciated to have been told from the voice on my crotch. Alright, Rookie. We can do this. And by we, I mean you. And by do, I mean inevitably fail. It's simple. Save the mayor, search the apartments, and get those people out. I'm starting to question whether or not he's actually a firefighter because I shouldn't be using an elevator when the building is on fire, right? That's, that's like the first thing that they tell you. Even children know that. Um, I would like out. I, I would like to go up. That That's what I meant. You meant to use elevators and fires. It's like the safest place to be or something. Plus, if you take the stairs, you don't get the music. The <laughs> music. It doesn't even look like there's a fire after all. Really? Yeah, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that there's a fire, jackass. It's fire for sure. It could be red cellophane or. Get it off! You guys okay? You you need some help? Okay. Well, I I've got hands. One of them is uh, throwing up the peace sign. Not totally sure why. I'm I'm not doing that. But yeah, right, let me just use that one. There we go. And it's the stuff. You, you're stuck underneath a broom. Really? Like, it's just a broom. Use your twiggy little paper arms. Okay, fine. I'm here to save you. Okay, go on. My life folded before my eyes. You're, you're welcome. Just, just walk through my chest. See if I give a shit. I guess I should be combating this along the way, right? Fire seems bad. There we go. Yeah, we could just get stuff and then move on. I think I just watched that person die while I listened to you talk. I probably could have saved him. Are you okay? Probably not. You don't look burnt. Right? Yeah, yeah, she'll, she'll be fine. She'll be fine. We'll just get rid of all the fire in here. So maybe open up a window. Would that be a good idea? Just let a little smoke out? No, nah, that's asking too much. Don't worry, guys. Everything is under control. My mom gave me my allowance early, so I managed to get two squirt guns this week. That's one more than my brother did, so don't even worry. You see, fire is under What the hell are you doing? Turn around! Go back! No exit! Make a U-turn! Sprack and do English? What? I, I, just, I just made an exit. I made a lovely exit. You see, now we can move... Forward. Why are there so many explosive things in a world full of paper? 
<gasps> What's explosive here? I don't understand. Hello? Is there anybody alive in here? You think anybody would mind if I made lunch real quick? Like, I know people are technically burning to death right now, but my lunch got interrupted. And I'm I'm just making a puddle. I'm wasting everybody's time. Here. Oh, dear. <laughs> How are you, sir? Madam? Not really sure. Is this what you're into? This is some teen-rated stuff right here. <laughs> Okay, you have been nice and doused. Everything, everything is safe here. You just keep that bed nice and wet, sir. And uh, I, I, I'm, I'm not gonna bother with lunch. You know what? I've lost my appetite. I'll, I'll see you later. Something's gonna explode, right? Explosions. No, uh, don't worry about it. Everything under control. Hopefully those weren't expensive doors. Hello? Jesus. You know the sound of somebody crapping themselves? That's impressive. Everything is going to be fine. The fire is under control and there's a very interesting naked man in the, oh, oh, okay, yeah. You, you, you don't worry about it. I can maybe fill up your tub a little bit? That might take too long. I, I should probably be firefighting, you know, doing my whole job thing. Can I, uh, there we go. Okay, we're gonna go upstairs. We're gonna get some high ground. Hello? Hello? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, I found somebody! I found you! I'm here, I'm here, and you're dead. No, you're not! You're not on fire! You're good! Will you stop panicking? What did I tell you about rule one being a firefighter? Okay, you don't raise your voice and you don't panic and there's a lot of people on fire. There are a whole lot of people on fire. They really love it when I squirt them in the face. Will you stop going away, Armageddon? I really need you right now. I need everybody to form a line in front of me and then calmly walk out of the building when the fire has been put out, okay? Do not walk out of the building while you're still on fire because you're just gonna burn down the rest of the town. I see that as being a very serious problem. I think there might be people in trouble over there. Maybe down there? Rule number 12, stay calm in difficult situations. That's rule number one! What did I tell you about rule number one? I, I, freaking, he doesn't listen, okay? I, I I should be the one in charge here. Stupid brooms, get the hell out of my way. Every, all that crap gets out of here. Okay, now, we can go... We can go further up, but I should probably go over there, right? I, I would say there's probably somebody over there that's in trouble first. I want to make sure that I get everybody. Hello? Is, is everybody safe? Are we all being safe in here? Hello? If an axe can't get through this, then a fire probably can't either. So I'm gonna assume that anybody in there is currently safe and we can move on. Okay, so we can go back over here, go up to the next floor. I'm doing a really good job, okay? I don't wanna pump my own water gun, but I I'm just saying that I'm, I'm pretty impressed with what I've managed to accomplish here. I hear people yelling, but you know, th th that's all just a, Part of the experience. Is everybody okay in here? Hello? Think, oh, 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 there's, there's one over there. There's one over there. There's one. There we go. You gotta pick them out. No problem. No, no problem. Oh, 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 okay. I hear pain. I hear, I hear pain. Don't worry. I'm, I'm coming. Hello? You got your butt on fire. There we go. Soppy butt for you. Yay! Soppy butt! Oh, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. High pressure, high pressure. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming. Why are there so many rooms in this apartment? You guys well off. Yeah, yeah, calm down, calm down. Calm down. Ooh, that, that was a little erotic. You you, you just calm down. Why are there so many people still burning? Oh my god, okay, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Here we go. Who's the mayor? Are you the mayor? Can I have lunch? You, you, can you make me lunch? No, don't don't leave, don't leave, okay? As a firefighter, trust me, when I tell you that everything is safe, everything behind me will no longer be on. Sorry about that, I keep knocking you over. <laughs> I just want lunch! How about in here? Anything of interest? We have, uh, more fire. Great. Oh, you guys are trapped. Hold on, hold on, it's just a broom. It's just a broom, okay? Everything is fine. You're not helping, okay? You're, you're not helping. Just get out of here, there. 
No, move! 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 Yes, an angel! Now, now, get, now get moving! Get, get moving! That, that's right, just to smell the floor. Anybody else? What is with the explosions? I don't understand. There is so much fire in here. Who would have thought that a world made out of cardboard and paper would be so flammable and yet so unprepared for this? I, I'm really confused. I thought that was somebody's dead arm, but it's just a broom. We're good. I think I've saved just about everybody, right? What's going on in here? Some kind of illegal activities. Hello? Can I? I can't even go in there. Okay. Well, you guys just keep playing your poker game, and I, I guess I'll just screw off. Oh, never mind. It was just that little bit of debris on the floor that was confusing me. Uh, you guys are playing with your cards the wrong way. House? I really shouldn't be surprised considering, you know, all of this that's happening around you. Let me just work my way through. You guys have a good day. Okay, it's like I said, everything behind me will be safe. The fire will hopefully not spread and explode anymore. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure that's gonna be the case. This is not how I hope my life would end. Wait, I'm not there. <laughs> uh, well, rookie. I just want to remind you that we don't offer life insurance. And even if we did, could you really put a price on life? Yes. Yes, you could. I'm sure that there is some price that would really help me when I get burned alive. Oh, my God. Just, that's not good. That's not good. That's, that's a gas pipe, right? Why do you guys have paper gas? And, and why is there a, a ghost lamp? Stop that ghost lamp. Okay, I, I hear screaming. Hello? Hello? I'm looking for the mayor. Is the mayor in here? I, I, were you the mayor? I think you might have been a table. Oh, mayor, are you home? Is anybody home? Did you guys all drink the Kool-Aid before I got here? What's... The, what's going on here? Were you hoping to make some kind of bed paper person baby? <laughs> wake up! I keep splashing them in the hopes that I'll wake them up, but nothing seems to really work. Why would they want water in this world? Now that I think about it, water is just as damaging as fire to paper. If you soak a paper person, I can see their little limbs warping and contorting and as they melt and just turn into pulp. That doesn't seem that much better than fire. Okay, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm coming. Just, just let me get all this really quick. There's, there's a whole lot going on behind me. And uh, a little bit of you. Ah, anything? Anybody? Mm, nope, nothing good. Okay, door number two. Ah, there we go. Why is everybody dead before I get there? Maybe it's because I ignore some of them? <laughs> Again, this is lovely. Very nice. Wish I could spend some time here. Time that wasn't spent saving stupid people's lives. I know, I know. Okay, you're the third one today. The exact same pile of garbage, too. Every freaking time. Now move, 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 move. Thanks, mate. You're welcome. Strange Australian paper person. Okay, then. Wait, there's the mayor's apartment. Rookie, we have to save the mayor or my ass is grass. Move, now. Don't worry, I'm spraying his pussy. Is the mayor completely out to lunch or oh, what? hello. Thank goodness you're here. <laughs> Friends, follow me. I've locked us off from the fire so it can harm us no more. God knows what it's capable of. You had a way out this entire time? And he was a little toilet paper roll man. <laughs> okay, so what, I... I can't give up on you like this. Let's try going back through. There's gotta be a way out. Why wouldn't you wait for me, little Judas toilet paper man? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, well, I guess... Excuse you? Who the hell is this guy? Okay, well, I guess you're getting sprayed. You're in the wrong end of town, dude, okay? Listen, I'm probably the one person that can actually combat you and kind of think that you're a doofus. What is he? He's just... Fire incarnate? He must be. I don't know. Oh, hey, have one of those. Oh, yeah, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> Listen, I'm not trying to excite you, strange fireball person. I'm just trying to get through this. This reminds me so much of old school arcade games. I really like this. 
<laughs> Am I actually getting anywhere? Do I need to like put this out first or what? Whoa, 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 no, 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 no. Hey, maybe. Oh yeah, you want to suck? Ow, ow, okay. Just wants to suck a whole lot and get wet and then spray on my face. This is, uh, this is not PG. <laughs> not even a little bit. You came here expecting the Armageddon 7000 not to screw with you. You have any idea what you're doing? Can I just hit you with more of those, I wonder? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, 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 careful, careful. Just, uh, that, I can't hit him with them. They're freaking difficult. Ah, uh, no, 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 not on my face, not on my face, not on my face. There we go. Come on, come on. I want to see if I can hit him with a water balloon to end this quicker, but it's so difficult. He's a real squirrel. There we go. There we go. There we go. Here we go again. Good. Let's get out of here. I'm pretty sure there's a service elevator somewhere. I even got my lunch. It's a little more done than I had hoped for, but it's better than nothing. Service elevator, service elevator. Through all the explosions, I would imagine? Yeah, that's usually the direction that I need to be going. Okay, okay, care, careful, careful. Fire, ow, fire really hurts, fire really, ow, fire, yeah, fire definitely hurts, fire definitely hurts. I need to get this crap out of the way, because apparently I'm too stupid to just crawl over it. There we go. Yes, okay, I get it. Just crank the shaft and squirt on his face and make him wet. And please, the innuendos, I just can't handle it. Next up, the cool breeze of safety. Should there not be stairs? I should be taking stairs. You know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Paperville Panic, guys. And I don't know all that much about this game. Like, I don't know how much more of it's left, but I do know that it's pretty much open world. Like, I get to explore around and interact with people and, I guess, fall into other scenarios that would require a firefighter. And if you guys want to see more of that, then be sure to leave a like on this video, let me know, and maybe I'll return again soon to save more stupid paper people. But thanks so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.